Thank you, Chair, uh, colleagues, Commissioner. As Rapporteur on Investments in Energy infrastru Infrastructure and Shadow Rapporteur on Security of Gas Supply, I am very sensitive to the issues of energy security, and I think Europe has a key role to play in this field. As a Romanian MEP, I have even more interest in this particular issue of the Kozlo nuclear plant. Being on the border of my country, it has long been a matter of preoccupation in Romania for obvious environmental reasons. The Kozlo power plant is situated 4 kilometers from the Danube River and 150 kilometers from Bucharest. According to international expertise, the plant does not have any protective cover and there are important risks of radioactive leakages in the soil and the water table. I believe Europe has a responsibility to help and facilitate its decommissioning and we have to ensure that sufficient funding be made available to this project as it is crucial to keep the safety up to high standards <clears throat> to ensure the necessary expertise and implement international best practices. The commissioning and dismantling should be done according to very strict rules and standards, otherwise it could pose a security threat to the whole region. This is why I fully support this proposal and our commitment to allocate additional 300 million euros to this project. Let me also remind you that the European Parliament took a strong stance a few months ago in this dossier, allocating the first 75 million euros in the 2010 budget. Nevertheless, I think we should be intransigent regarding transparency in the use of the European funds. So far, the Commission has been quite dissatisfied with the information on decommissioning received from Bulgaria. The monitoring of the funds needs to be strict. This is why I believe that the European Commission should first perform a specific evaluation to assess the strengths and weaknesses of the past projects in order to improve funds programming together with the EBRD for the next funding period 2010-2013. We have tabled several amendments requiring the authorities uh, from Bulgaria to present a proper national strategy outlining long-term objectives in the energy efficiency and the renewable energy sectors as a prerequisite to the 120 million euro envelope. Uh, and I hope the yes, also supported. Senora, Senora Valian,